now we will talk about the notification scheme i am creating this ticker i am updating the ticket or i'm closing the ticket anything is happening i should get the uh, email notification okay how i can get it so it solely depends on the notification scheme go to project setting go up you can see notification there is no email server got configured because i am using the localhost if you are using any uh, mail server then the email id you need to provide it over here so from that email id you are going to get the notification about the things and all we will discuss in another video let's talk about the notification scheme first okay you can see these are the uh, events are there and these are the notification is going to send it it's used by eight projects so i'm not going to change anything i am going to create the new one copy edit notification is scheme for test okay click on edit notification you can see issue created who is going to get current assignee reporter and all watcher i don't want to send this notification to watcher so like this you can delete it let's delete if issue get created only current issue and reporter i want to add developer as well click on add button here issue created you want project lead or anything you can select if you want to send it to the group or single user Totally depends on your use case. You can select. I am going to select project role. Here I am selecting developers. All developers should get the ticket. Okay, like this. Come here. Uh, refresh the page. Because I have created but not yet assigned. Just click on use a different one. Notification for Jira. See developer. So I have created it. So whenever you are going to create the ticket who will get the notification these three person will get current assignee whoever current reporter and project developer like this you can do that okay if you want to create another notification how you can do that click on add notification and here you can select if you want to create a generic event you can select the generic event also how you are going to create the generic event i will show you that i will show in the different uh, video because that will take time for now this is so like this you can create the notification scheme you can edit it you can delete the notification scheme if you don't want anything in your notification whatever is happening you don't want in the over the email come over come here click on notification scheme use a different scheme here none associate no one will get the notification so like this you can do that thank you for watching